Hi friends, welcome to another Figma tutorial. In this video, we will see how to utilize overlays in your prototype. So what is overlay? Overlay is a screen or an object which is projected above another screen. Here you, here you can see calendar and uh, one frame here which is uh, created for payment summary. Okay. So here, if you place this screen above this payment summary screen, it is an overlay. This screen is an overlay. So we will see how this overlay works. You don't need to create a number of frames or duplicate the frame to do, to do this animation. If you click on this drop down, here you can see drop down menu. If you click on this drop down menu, this calendar should appear below this. I think you have understood. So I will repeat again. So overlay is nothing but it is a screen that is projected above another screen. Here calendar is the overlay. It is projected above the payment summary screen or frame. So let's see how this animation or prototype works without duplicating frames so we need to create an animation for this drop down menu so double click on it yeah okay one minute yeah so here you can see we have selected this drop down menu you can create uh, this same method you can use the same method for this share button if you click on this share button uh, one overlay will appear which includes the share inputs uh, share tools so you can create the, uh, this um, share button animation or notification button animation in the same way okay so i am here saying telling you uh, one example which is a uh, here we are going to do okay so if you move the mouse over this uh, round circle blue round circle you can see plus symbol here plus plus icon okay the, if you don't see it is you are not in prototype mode okay you are in design mode the, in design mode you cannot see that in, you have to go to prototype so I think you all know that basic that is basic things okay here you can see the plus sign plus sign means you can just extend this uh, line to connect to another frame or screen here I am just connecting this drop down menu to calendar screen see we have created a connection here so when you do that one interaction details box will appear which includes tools for our animation here you can see on top navigate to and this one this is an option for uh, choosing which frame you want to connect here i have chosen calendar because we, we want to connect this drop down menu to calendar and you can see instant animation preset scroll options like that things in this one uh, on top uh, draw, uh, in, in on top thing we just click on this here you can see the drop down <laughs> menu here also look when we click on this one overlays also appeared like like this um, we are going to see how this kind of overlays are created so let's click on on top and you can see lots of animations here um, on drag while hovering while pressing mouse center mouse leave you can just try it on uh, it depends on your needs so here i'm just choosing touch up here you can see the touch up so i have clicked touch up and go to this one where you need to navigate but here we you don't need to navigate you uh, here you can see open open overlay scroll to zap overlay back close overlay open link here you need to open overlay because this is a uh, calendar is our overlay when we click on this drop dot menu so just 
give the option open overlay so here you can see one screen will be appeared okay before coming to that i will show you sometimes if you do this in overlay this option will be in this rendered don't worry so you will see with uh, this centered one how that things works okay if you click on top left top center top right it will appear on that place if you click on top left top center top right if i'll show you if you click on this top right this overlay will appear here let's see how it works okay let's click on the play button let's see see okay it's taking a little time because our figma update is going on that's why okay let's so oh yeah it's opening let's see how how it appears yeah so if you click on this drop down or drop down menu overlay will appear here because we have given the option for that only so see uh, we will we'll see how to change that option if you have given top right that's why this overlay is appearing in top right okay so instead of that i usually prefer give manual option so you can just place this uh, calendar or screen or overlay wherever you want so i'm just keeping this calendar here i think it is visible for you okay yeah i am just placing this calendar here uh, around 24 this okay yeah i am just placing calendar here see the difference now see the difference so i am just refreshing now i am just pressing drop down menu see the calendar have or overlay have came in place that we fixed that we need so calendar is appeared in the place that we need so that is why we i told you to give option manual and after that i think you are, you are just understanding if you don't understand don't worry please comment below i will give you reply okay don't worry so here uh, uh, after this giving this manual option and and look uh, if you go through this itself you can understand easily okay don't worry about it i just uh, explained to you if you see this uh, top right you can logically you can uh, think okay this thing will uh, when you click on top right it will appear here you can logically think about it but if you give manual you can move this uh, overlay anywhere you want in this frame in this frame okay after giving this uh, options and all you have to choose this option close when clicking outside when this overlay appears it should close no so when you click outside uh, of in, of frame it should close so we have to give this option it is very important option so so far we have given a uh, touch up option open overlay because we need to open this overlay or screen and we have given manual because we need to move this overlay on this frame anywhere we need okay after that we have tick mark this close when clicking outside so we have given everything so the process is over i think you all understood um, about this uh, prototype overlay prototype in figma and we we are going to see the animation let's restart you can press r or here you can see you see my mouse pointer is here 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 yeah here itself so click on it now it is restarted that animation is restarted now click on drop down menu see the calendar have appeared when you click outside this calendar it it automatically close see it it automatically closed when you click on drop down menu it will appear 
we have given manual option for placing this calendar overlay so that's why it's appearing in the place that i needed or we needed and if you need to close this just click on it see the option works so just uh, take screenshot of this um, interaction details then it it will be easy for you to refer so i think you guys understood uh, please if you don't uh, understand uh, please uh, give comment uh, i will reply thank you friends the, uh, uh, we'll see in another figma tutorial video if you like this video please do subscribe like and share love